I am the pelican. I am free to fly anywhere I wish. I glide silently up and down the beach, searching for food, ever searching. I am the pelican. I am free to soar anywhere I wish. I fly and glide out over the waves, diving for fish, ever diving. I am the pelican. I am free to roost anywhere I wish. I settle gracefully down among the reeds, where I mate and raise my fledglings. I am the pelican. I am ignorant of what man has unleashed. I am oblivious to the danger of man-made chemicals. I simply live my life as my kind have done since the beginning of time. I am the pelican. I could care less about British petroleum. The only interest I have is in the vantage point I get when perched high above the gulf atop the oil rigs. I am the pelican. I live by the natural order of the world. I care not that the water below me looks different. I know not that the air I breathe is acrid with poisons. I am the pelican. My natural instincts are to search for sustenance, and in order to do that, I must dive directly into the dark and murky crude. I am the pelican. I do not understand why I cannot see my prey under the water. I do not understand when I raise my wings, they feel heavy. I do not understand why I cannot lift my oil-laden body from the water. I am the pelican. I have never been forced to be a prisoner of the Gulf waters. I do not understand why I cannot just flap my great wings and effortlessly rise into the air. I am the pelican. I am drifting helplessly upon the waves. I am being pushed in spite of my determined paddling toward the breakers along the beach. I am the pelican. I am no longer floating or drifting. My oil-drenched feathers are my enemy now. I am too heavy to rise above each wave as it crashes down upon my body. I am the pelican. I've never been caught in a struggle against the surf. The only thing I know to do to escape the punishment of the pounding waves is to flap my wings and fly up and away, but it's not working. I am the pelican. I have never known what it is like to be earthbound. I have never known desperation, never known such stark terror. I open my beak to emit one last pleading call to my mate. I am the pelican. As each wave pulses down upon my desperately flailing, outstretched wings, I can feel the tendons being pulled agonizingly to their breaking point. I feel my instinct to fight beginning to ebb. I am the pelican, covered completely in thick poisonous crude oil, barely able to breathe, barely able to see, barely able to move. I can no longer struggle. I am the dying pelican. I allow my oil-covered, battered, and tortured body to go limp, and I surrender to await the inevitable end. I have no remaining strength and have lost the valiant fight, not with nature, but with mankind.